Hey guys, it's Mr. Jack and Triple Zero here, back with Automation the Car Company Tycoon game, and in today's video, in the most powerful engine series, we're gonna build the most powerful Boxer 4 engine in this game as of right now. I've seen some YouTube videos out there, and I've explained this in my Boxer 6 video, where I got up to 2900 horsepower. I've seen people who have, uh, making Boxer 4 engines, trying to make it the most powerful ones, where they got up to like 18 and 1900 RPM, but I think we can get up to like 2000 horsepower, which you can tell by the thumbnail. So right now, I'm gonna show you how I made the most powerful Boxer 4 engine in this game. First of all, like always, put to your 2020 to get the most performance, reliability, and everything in the engine. And of course, it's a box of four with magnesium block material. It can be anything, but magnesium is the best despite the high cost. And crank this up to 120 millimeters bore and stroke to get it to the size of 5,429 cubic centimeters or 5.4 liters with a dual over cam 5 valve made out of aluminum silicone. Crank car rods and pistons, you know the drill, billet steel, lightweight titanium, and regular forged to make it the strongest and most reliable as possible with the quality maxed out to plus 15. For the compression, set it to a 10.0 to 1 with the cam profile set to almost all the way up to a 99, almost to a 100 with VVT at all cams. For the turbocharger, ball bearings of course with the intercooler set to 2,980 horsepower with the compressor at 92.5 millimeters right here, turbine at 72.5, AR ratio cranked it all the way up to 1.4, the max boost cranked it all the way up to 43.5 PSI. Fuel system, like always, direct injection, throttle per cylinder, race intake of ultimate fuel, 10.0 mixture, with the ignition timing I bumped it up to a 62, and the RPM same as my Boxer 6 to an 8800 RPM. For the exhaust, it's going to be a dual exhaust. You don't have to crank the exhaust all the way. It can be up to 159, point, uh, 159 millimeters, which makes it a 6.25 inch exhaust diameter. And no cats, no mufflers whatsoever, which we get up to 2,055.2 horsepower at 8,800 RPM with the torque at 1,240.5 foot-pounds of torque at 8,500 RPM. So right now, I'm going to be giving you an automatic test of what the engine sounds like, and then I'll play around with it with the manual test while showing every single graph on here, like the power, efficiency, boost, and stuff like that. So right now, I'll start the automatic test, and then play around with the manual. Hopefully Subaru is listening to this because <laughs> this will definitely put them out of business. So that'll do it with Automation the Car Cubby Tycoon game. Well, I got all the Boxer engines done since I only got two to choose from, the Boxer 4 and Boxer 6. I'm going to take a break on the most powerful engine series and focus on my car builds and other games that I showcase on my channel. During the break in the series, I'm planning on moving over to the inline series like the inline 3, 4, 5, and 6 engines and see how powerful I can make them. That'll happen sometimes in the future. It won't be my next video after this, but maybe in the next coming weeks or so. It won't be for that long, I can tell you that. So this has been Mr. Jack and Triple Zero. I'll see you in the next video.